everybody, welcome to my channel. If you're new, welcome to my channel. I'm about to act like a vlogger for a second. I just filmed my room tour for my single and my suite. Sorry if you can hear my stomach growling. I'm really, really, really hungry. This isn't even a vlogging camera, but um, you know, I was thinking about doing a vlogging at one point. Okay, I'm getting really off topic. I filmed my room tour and it is a very, very, very simple compared to the one that I film a sophomore year and it's a lot different because I'm in a single instead of a double. Not very detailed room tour but there's not really much to go through I guess. I think I took too much time two years ago. That was definitely the problem but I really hope that you enjoy this room tour and my arm's getting really tired. I don't know how people do this. This is the problem. I always try and get my hair accessory in a frame and I don't even know if it's in the frame if you can see it. But I really hope that you like this video and I wanted to film it for you before I start packing because I want to remember this room because I really like how I end up decorating it. Let's get on to the video. <laughs> didn't know I live in a single in a suite of five people usually there's six but we have an empty spot and so when you first go into my room you have my mirror and then I have my wallet that's hanging and then over here I have this basket it used to be a mess but I just cleaned it I have this package for um, strip lights that I have in our common room and I have some purses and crossbody bags ran a backpack from a career fair and then Ikea was there so I really want the backpack and then I keep some hair accessories over here and I also sometimes keep my camera and it's like little small case just for easy access even though I have another spot where I actually keep my camera and then right here I have my huge huge portfolio and just some prints of my photographs and then right here I have my pineapple canvas and I believe I got that from Marshall so it's be a pineapple stand tall wear a crown and be sweet it's gold sparkly and I love the design of it then here you see my whole desk starting over here we have my whole makeup section this container was from the container store as well as this brush holder right there moving on over here i have my desk from bed bath and beyond and in it i just have some hand sanitizer and then i have my two most used essential oils and i just mentioned them in a favorites video so you should go check that out then i have my oil diffuser which i also mentioned in that current favorites video and that's from amazon and and actually I can turn the light on I can stop it on a color or I can turn it off but right now I just have it turned off I have my makeup mirror it's actually my mom's she lets me use it for college and it has like a few different settings a zoom but I'm not using it I just keep it like that and then I have my hustle a magnetic board probably does not look magnetic because it's like a canvas kind of it's like really weird so I had my schedule for senior week that's coming up soon but I decided to take that off because of dates and times and location and then I have this long strip of piece of paper. My advisor gave it to us from her class last semester and it says how to feel good as an artist or craft person it has 10 things really good advice and then right here I have a really old picture of me I probably look sad in it I'm sitting on my mommy's lap and my mom is covering her eyes from the sun and my aunt is in the corner but I just really like the photo I have my Christmas lights all around this area to be realistic we're not supposed to have string lights and um, plug-in lights but people do anyway and honestly it completes a room so much when I've had to hide these away like it looks completely bare and I think it just adds something to your room so like if you can get away with it and hide it like I recommend it I sound like such a bad influence right now it really does make a difference and I just have a water bottle and then I have my pencil cup pretty sure I got this at Marshall's I just have pens pencils sharpies drawing supplies basically then right here I have my business cards for my capstone presentation tomorrow and my my phone. This is a Kate Spade case and then there's a pineapple pop socket on there and my lens cap. And then we can go into my desk. So I have my chair here and I have this big long drawer that actually goes down. And here you will see just a bunch of random stuff, you know, your regular junk drawer. And so I just have a certificate here from Leadership Development Program and I just have like the basic essentials, pencils, band-aids, pin tacks, earplugs. Um, these are from CVS and I highly recommend 
recommend them. They're really cheap, but they work so well. They're soundproof. And then I have an extra remote for the strip lights, staples, painter's tape. I have my headphones. I got this case at TJ Maxx, and I don't think I've ever had headphones for like over two years before, so shout out to that because that has saved my headphones many, many times. I then have more essential oils, my pencil case, coupons and gift cards, gum, a stress ball, my GoPro USB thingy, a ruler. Oh, these are amazing. They're called Handy Talk. I got them from Bed Bath & Beyond and they're literally only $1.99. use it to like stick pictures on the wall or like I used it for um, our glow in the dark stars in our common room and they have stayed and not moved. So highly recommend these. We go into my first drawer here. This is another junk drawer. I actually just cleaned out even though it doesn't look like it. But I basically just have like my stapler, my tape dispenser, sunglasses, my supplements that I just did a video on. Shameless promo for my videos. Advil, other supplements, vitamins, hair scrunchies that were just in my favorite video, NyQuil, <laughs> you know, the essentials. Nicer jewelry over there as well as regular jewelry and a cord for my shower speaker and just a bunch of other like random things. And then over here it just has my notebooks and binders and everything else and I'm not showing the whole drawer because I have my senior portraits right there and it has my address on it so I'm not going to show that but there's really not much to this drawer and then I have my charger for Clarisonic so I have that in there just randomly. This is kind of like more like a storage drawer. So I have my Bose speaker here, extra home supplements that just came in, and then I have some books there. And then I have like a random dry shampoo in here, and leather spray. I have my curling wand set for Numi. I have extra makeup cases for when I'm traveling and when I move in and out of school. The book stand right here. I had the Brandon Wolfville Luminescence book right there. Command hooks, more vitamins, extra supplements, this is really awesome if you curl your hair or straighten your hair. Basically you like put it on there so you're not putting it on a random surface that could potentially catch on fire. Then I have a candle in there. Also another thing you're not supposed to have but I have a candle warmer so it's fine. Totally fine. And then we have my trash. You know, super cool, whatever. On this wall I have some decor. So these three canvases I painted after my freshman year of college. So this one's a and Elizabeth painted it in gold hot glue gun and I drew on the letters and the drips and I painted over it very carefully with gold paint and then this one I painted Lily Pulitzer it was a picture that I saw on Pinterest and I was like I really want to paint that so I did and then over here is a Lily Pulitzer quote once again another picture of a quote that I painted from and this took a really long time for the lettering because I used a super tiny brush but I really like all my canvases and then I have this I'm trying not to get a glare. If you remember one of my best friends, Liv, from a past video, she made this for me for an, an identity project. So you have me right there. It's an older photo. A camera there because I'm a photography major and also, of course, I film videos for YouTube. I love makeup and I love the color blue. And then that's my birthday in Roman numerals. Right here I have this little firefly photo clip thing that I got from TJ Maxx. I put a photo or two from each country that I went to and so that's like really important to me. I have three backpacks over here. The Swiss Army backpack that I use for traveling and when I go home. I have my gym backpack right here. It's by Roxy that I got in high school and then I have my Vera Bradley school backpack right there. Over here is my bed. This body pillow from Bed Bath & Beyond. This pineapple sheet set pretty sure it was from TJ Maxx. It's um Ralph Lauren I think. And then I have this pillowcase set that I also got from TJ Maxx and it's just of the world map and then I have my elephant stuffed animal that I got for my 20th birthday shout out to Marina I love it and then um, and Marina and I also made animals it was kind of like a build-a-bear event so I made a unicorn a couple years ago my comforter is from Kate Spade but I got it at TJ Maxx for a very discounted price because I used to have the navy blue version that was right when that came out at Bed Bath & Beyond a random old sheet just to cover this area so it looks cleaner and neater under my bed so in this rolly cart i decorated myself here i keep like bras and underwear and here i keep my socks and like a belt or two and then here i keep all my shorts here i keep my hats 
up and then I keep random bath necessities and then, like a photo thing here I keep all like my nail stuff my laundry items in this little area and then over there that container that's from the container store and that's filled with just like extra products this has all my feminine products in here if you have an extra fab fit fun box laying around it's a great place to put it and then I have an extra fab fit fun box here that has all my props from my independent studio this semester I'm not gonna go much into detail it's mostly just storage painting items a suitcase back there and a bunch of Williamson own bags that are amazing if you need a bag to put stuff in or like moving things out and everything I have my red and polka dot blanket back there from limited to from seventh grade still use it it's still a great blanket and then I have some towels over there and I have my cords a laptop in my trunk that just has a bunch of storage in there so not much going on down here and then I have a step stool because my bed is super high it's from Bed Bath & Beyond over here we have my drawers and then I have my eye mask from a fab fit fun box I have my pillow mess that I don't really use anymore I have extra brushes in this morphe yep morphe case my mom gave it to me and then I have this little shock glass from Burn Switzerland just a collectible don't worry and then I have a one minute bible for students that I got in high school and then I have my makeup palettes so I got Tarte, NARS, Ish, It Cosmetics, Anastasia Beverly Hills, Naked Palette, Bare Minerals and I had way more in here but I took out the ones that I wasn't using and this letters thing I don't know I forgot exactly what it's called but it's from Joanne Fabrics and then up here we have two canvases that are also from Joanne Fabrics so one says let's explore and one says travel often I made this canvas at the same time I made the other ones and it's just forest and a night sky basically and so to get into my drawers really quickly right here I have a lot of my long sleeves and sweaters but they're more like for spring and then I have my short sleeves and then I have tank tops and bralettes and my second drawer I have a bunch of jeans in these two sections and I also have sweatpants um joggers and leggings in here and then I have scarves that I thought I was gonna wear but didn't you're always gonna bring stuff that you don't end up using or wearing this is my exercise drawer all these shirts and tank tops I use when I'm exercising some sports bras back there some are missing from the store I have my lawn sleeves three pairs of leggings and then two shorts here is like my lounge and pajama drawer so i have long sleeves short sleeves this was like completely full before but i had my dad take up like half my room my room has never looked this clean before i mean very neat and clean but not like this so a lot of things are empty and then i have like shorts over here this is probably my messiest drawer because it's all sweatshirts and i try to clean it up but honestly reality of it they're so bulky some of them and it's yeah it's just gonna look like that so that's that also really comfy sweatshirts are at airy so highly recommend then we have my closet here shower curtain is from bed bath and beyond like half of this stuff in here and then here we have my closet and it's sorted by color so it goes lightest to darkest I actually have like my grad cap and gown in there it's so weird to say shoe boxes up there there's nicer shoes right there this is my camera case it's actually like a Nikon case but it was given to me when I had my Nikon camera so many years ago and I kept it just because it's what I had at the moment and then right here I'm gonna insert a picture of it but I got a camera backpack for my birthday this is what it came in so I just keep that in there when I'm not using it I have my shoes so these don't look like it but they are shoe boxes from the container store so I got my Vans Converse sandals from Steve Madden and then I'm a Spiries got my shower sandals from Bed Bath & Beyond flip-flops from American Eagle Nike sneakers Ugg slippers Sam Edelman and boots my booties from blondo and these are from paul green also my heels they were in these boxes but they're also from sam edelman and they're my go-to going out shoes basically my only going out shoes and they lace up you've probably seen them in my instagram if you follow me out there that is it for today's video i hope you enjoyed make sure to subscribe if you want to see more videos click that bell button if you want to be notified when i upload right then and there i hope you have a great day and i'll see you later bye